everyone. Good to see all your lovely faces. It's that time again. Time for another takeover. Hey, Sonic. Knuckles and Amy are right behind me. Hey, Tails. Perfect. We're just about ready to get started. Wow. I really like what you've done with the place. Yeah, it's decorated in commemoration of our time on the North Star Islands. I don't care how it's decorated. I'm ready to answer every single question that comes our way. Ah, uh, we probably won't have time for every single question, but we're ready for you all to ask us whatever you want, and we'll answer as many as we can. You can ask about our past adventures, our favorite hobbies, our dreams, just about anything on your mind. Hey, where's Shadow? Huh, he'd never miss one of these things if he could help it. Oh, he was busy today, but asked if I could relay a message. Let me grab it. It says... If anyone asks, my favorite flower is Lantanus. What? I bet he's just scared someone will ask him to marry them again. Or he's just napping. Kind of like while we were running all over the North Star Islands, he was asleep in a little capsule. Either way, he'll be missed. And I'm sure he'll be at the next one. Is this everyone now? <laughs> Shadow may not be here, but you know, other than the blue rat, I'm the only one with a perfect attendance record here. Wouldn't have it any other way. Wait, really? No, but we really need to get started. <clears throat> All right, everyone, it's time to send us in your questions with the hashtag AskSonic, and we'll answer on Twitter and TikTok. Uh, can we still call it that? I'm still gonna call it that. You know, I think I kind of prefer X. Oh, you would. But it feels more industrial. All right, no bickering, boys. Let's start jumping into these questions. Ooh, I can't wait to see what everyone's going to ask us this time. See you soon! Question from at MetroGamer21. How often do you keep your quills sharp? Do you brush it yourself or have someone else do it? Um, <laughs> I don't do anything with my quills. I let the wind do what it wants to it. You don't have a routine at all? Well, I just so happen to have some mustache wax on me. How about we give it a try? Mm, doesn't look much different. Probably getting pointy. Well, I have this pencil sharpener on me if we want to give that a try. And <laughs> Look at that, we're out of time. Thanks for the question at MetroGamer21. All right, question from at design... Okay, Knuckles, I just got to know what's under your gloves. Is it weird spiked hands, or is it just the design of the gloves? What are you, a cop? I'm not telling. Well, there you have it. Thanks for the question, at... Thanks for the question. This question is from at Silent Nayuri. They ask Eggman, <clears throat> out of every machine you built, which one was your favorite? They're not a robot per se, but I'd be remiss not to mention the twinkle of my eye and the reason I keep existing my darling daughter, Sage. Uh, you really brought up the AI daughter you made? Boring. Yeah, come on, give us a deep cut. A robot you were really proud of, but we crushed in seconds. Fine, you little twerps. The, uh, the Egg Salamander, that's my favorite robot. Your favorite robot is a salamander? My favorite robot is this little vacuum I made recently. It's efficient and cats love it. Oh, Tails, could you make me one? My genius is wasted on you lot. Thanks for the question, at Silent Nayori. This question is from at Prisma underscore Sonic to Sonic. Have you ever wondered if there were other versions of you out there asking for a friend? <laughs> oh, guy, I sure hope not. Uh, well, other than my past self that keeps showing up, I've never considered other me's. Well, that's fine. You're my one perfect Sonic. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hope there's a red Sonic out there. Good color. I hope there's a Sonic out there that's my best friend. Oh, wait. That's you. <laughs> wait. I hope there's a Sonic out there with laser eyes, right? Laser eyes would be way more helpful than what you could do now. You know what? I'm going to stop this now. Thanks for the question, at Prisma underscore Sonic. Wait. We are best friends. Right, Sonic? <laughs> of course, buddy. Well, this question is for me from at Daniel Newbidden. For Sonic, who in the group do you think is the prettiest? Oh, uh-oh. Well, Sonic, me and my distinguished mustache are waiting. Um, what makes you think Sonic's gonna say anything nice about you, Eggman? Not 
while I'm wearing such a fashionable dress. Hey, I'm fashionable too. Look at my yellow-orange fur. It shines, sparkles even. Hey, hey, touch my arm. Baby smooth, baby smooth. Ew. Knuckles, you don't want to argue that you're the prettiest? No. Well, uh, maybe we'll let the audience decide. <laughs> Thanks for the question, at Daniel Newbignan. You can tell me later. What was that? Nothing, nothing. From at Rayfun underscore 25028 to Knuckles. <laughs> I always wondered, how are you able to glide, actually? Only Kidna can glide. We simply bend the wind. You do what now? I think he said he breaks wind. No, I said... We know what he said. Thanks for the question at Rayfun25028. Tails, what does break wind mean? It means farting. Hey! <laughs> question coming in hot from at Bluebler68. Let's see. For Sonic, since you guys were in Eggman's dream, what would Sonic's dream be like? <laughs> Probably boring if you ask me. Nice. You know, I actually had a dream recently. Yeah, I was protecting the city from Eggman's robots and nobody cared. I took care of everything and everyone was fine, but no one seemed to notice. Should we analyze this? I think we should analyze this. What? No, I, I, I mean, I mean it's, it's just a dream. It doesn't mean... Sonic, is everyone ignoring your heroic deeds? It's a reflection of how you feel in real life. Do you need positive reinforcement? Sonic, you're the best. Everyone loves you. Sonic, you are very good at uh, what you do. Oh, I'm oddly touched. Well, thanks for the question, at Blue Blur 68 You know, I had a dream recently where the Master Emerald was talking to me, and... I think we'll have to unpack that later, Knuckles. Aww, this next one's from at... SelkadomBomb1N. They said, Hey gang, big fan here. Today's takeover is actually very special because it's also my 19th birthday. Aww. If it's not too much to ask, can I get a happy birthday serenade from your beautiful singing voices? <laughs> well, I'd never deny anyone the gift of my magical voice. Yeah, everyone sang for me a few years ago. I want to join in this time. All right, everyone. A one, and a two, and a three, and a four, and... Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear and many more. <laughs> Thanks for the question, Selka. Oh, and happy birthday. I At Razor, oh, asks, are there any moments where going fast is not the best option? I don't know. Going fast has never failed me before. Well, what about the time you sped into a Zeddy trap and I got trapped stopping you? Or when you ran straight into a spike pit I warned you about. Or when you ran so fast you wrecked my glorious creations. Yeah, actually that last one is a good thing. Yeah, I don't mind that he did that. Like I said, going fast has never failed me before. Thanks for the question, that razor. Oh, and just so you know, I love computers. <laughs> Tails! What? I do. This question is from at that black hole VT to Eggman. What would your fursona be? Huh? Huh? If you were a cuddly critter like us, which would you be? Like, maybe a sly fox or a fierce wolf? I was thinking more like a sloth for Eggman. Or a baby flicky. Uh, no, no, the pink-haired girl might be onto something. With the speed of a fox or the bite of a wolf, I, I could potentially be unstoppable. Yes, I'll create an invention. An invention that turns anyone into loyal animals. Forget robots! Have a fierce army of beasts! All right, Eggman's losing it. Thanks for the question, at that black hole VT. <laughs> a persona for everyone! <laughs> question from at Hannah W underscore 1031 to Amy. When or how did you get into reading fortune cards, and where did you get them? Fortune cards are an old hypofixation of mine that I couldn't help but get back into. I'm obsessed! 
We know. You haven't stopped talking about it. <laughs> the card I drew today said you'd be a big grump, and it was right. You don't see me teasing your rock collection. Uh, that's because my rock collection is awesome. Look at this one. Look, it looks like a little gnome living in a forest. Oh, I can see this going on for a while. Thanks for the question, at Hannah W underscore 1031. This fortune card has the Master Emerald printed on it. Wait, really? Oh, I'm gonna keep that one. Hey, get that back! Question from at Real Method One as fan to Amy Rose. How was the concert with Shadow? Did you go to any other concerts by any chance? Oh, I'm happy you asked. We had a lovely time. <laughs> I even bought Shadow a hot honey shirt. I didn't get a photo, but um, maybe a fan could draw it. Really? I can't picture Shadow at a concert. Oh, he sang, he danced a little, it seemed like he had fun. Why, Sonic, are you jealous? <laughs> jealous? Me? No way! All I'm saying is that I'm great company at a concert. Okay, Sonic, we'll have to go to a concert together. Um, just the two of us, if that's okay. Oh, uh, well, I, I was, I, I mean, that doesn't sound, well, yeah, uh, <laughs> In that case, everyone here is invited! Oh, <laughs> yeah! I'll be in the mosh pit. <laughs> yeah, so, sounds great. Thanks for the question, at Real Mephi's 1ES fan. I better start practicing my line dance. At Digidevil Trig asks Sonic, if you're the fastest thing alive, why did you use the train to go to the Mystic Ruins? <laughs> I don't know. Trains are fun. Is that really it? Well, supporting public transportation is always a plus. Some cities just don't put enough support behind it. Ladies and gentlemen, he really is a hero. Thanks for the question at Digidevil Trig. Choo choo! At Sonic underscore Sunset asks, We know Sonic was a huge inspiration for Tails, but does he have other sources of inspiration? Like Dr. Eggman's machinery, for example. I have to say something nice about Eggman? <laughs> you sure do. I'm sure it won't be hard. My flawless inventions are nothing short of genius. I admire your, uh, work ethic. My uh, what? Your work ethic. You always have a goal, and you always come slightly to very close to completing it. It's commendable. Oh. Eggman, are you about to cry? I don't think he gets complimented very much. I, uh, I, I hold myself to a strict schedule. I, I keep a calendar. I do weekly check-ins with my robots. You know, if you have another compliment for me, I'd really appreciate... No. Yeah, can't hate a guy for trying. Thanks for the question, at Sonic Sunset. You really were brave to give Eggman a compliment, little buddy. I know. At 45 UV asks, for everyone, if you were a cake, what flavor would you be? If we were cakes, <laughs> I'd be a strawberry shortcake. Cute, sweet, and fresh. <laughs> I'd choose a checkered cake. You can never choose just one flavor. I gave it some thought. I think I'd be a sponge cake. Light and delightful. I know what cake I wouldn't be. <laughs> wouldn't be. No! Strawberry shortcake sucks! All right, Sonic, get over here! You can't get away! Question from at Valixi. To everyone, if Sonic was a worm, would any of you guys still like him? But no, I would still hate Sonic if he was a worm. I think I'd also hate Sonic if he was a worm. Well, I think you two are missing out. I'd make for an awesome worm. Yeah, can you imagine? A worm traveling at light speed? Uh, I don't know about that, Tails. I don't think Sonic would keep his speed. Now you're just making up rules. Sonic would be a really fast worm, and I'd love him all the same. Did you scream at a bug flying towards you and run away from a sidewalk slug? Okay, those don't count. Those weren't my darling Sonic. Eh, uh, sure they don't. Anywho, thanks, at Valixi. I'll get started on turning Sonic into a worm. Sounds good. Wait, no, no, don't do that. <laughs> Too late, Wormick. At Tails Austin 9922 asks the class, what is something that you don't do very well that you would like to improve on? <laughs> Everything I do is perfect. Next! Uh, I could be a bit more confident in myself. 
I feel like I lean a bit too much on my friends. Don't worry, Tails. That's what we're here for. I could learn to be more independent myself. I'm actually looking to be less independent. Get off Angel Island more often and see the world. Oh, that's so sweet, everyone. See, everything I do is perfect. Sonic! So... <laughs> Thanks for the question, at Tails Austin 9922. Okay, question from at Joby Tropy. They ask, if the five of you could swap roles with someone for an entire day, who would each of you choose? Don't hate me, but I'd swap with Eggman. Getting a hold of his tech would be a dream come true. Sorry, Tails, but I'd swap with Sonic. Can you imagine the devastation I could cause with his speed? <laughs> I'd probably also swap with Sonic. Or maybe Tails. <laughs> Shopping would be a breeze if I could fly around. Where does that leave me? Swapping with Amy? I could just take her hammer. <laughs> Good luck taking my hammer. Already got it. Oh, and, oh. Actually, I should have seen that coming. Thanks for the question, at Jumpy Trophy. At creator super long underscores X asks, is it painful to give Knuckles a fist bump or a handshake? Yes, very painful. Do not recommend. Oh, it can't be that bad. Why don't you punch yourself and see for yourself? Okay. <clears throat> I don't know, guys. I'm not really feeling anything. Uh, thanks for the question, Creator X. Hey, Knuckles, stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> At Squidboy7674 asks, Eggman, do you do commissions? Like, can I pay you to build me a custom badnik all for me? Because that would be really cool, I think. What? Is that an actual thing people are interested in? Can I make money off this? If the bad things you make start attacking people, then probably not. Hmm, good point. Uh, maybe I could make my robots not evil and more like uh, animatronics. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I can put them in places where people can find them, like um, pizza restaurants. Wait, you want to make robots that would perform at pizza restaurants? Hmm, why does that sound familiar? Maybe we should move on. Thanks for the question, at Squidboy7674. At Typhon Twister asks, you guys have beaten a ton of baddies over the years. This might be a little weird, but who was your favorite to fight, besides the good doctor, of course? Huh. Well, I both loved and hated kicking Fang's butt on the North Star Islands. Oh, chaos was tough for me to fight. I feel like I really came into my own from that adventure. Neo Metal Sonic gave me such a headache. He just wouldn't go down! i fought some ghosts, and I think I've gotten pretty good at it, but I'd prefer to never see one again. Wait! I changed my answer! The end! Teaming up with my friends, Eggman and Sage, to take a narcissistic planet down was legendary! Huh? Sonic can change his answer before I even speak? What are you gonna say? You really only fight against us. Yeah, good point. Thanks for the question, at Typhon Twister. This question's from Jack. For Eggman, why did you get rid of the yellow cape? It was so fashionable. You know what? Good point. Orbot, Cuba, fetch me my yellow cape. Oh, wait, I'm not home. Yeah, why don't you wear your yellow cape anymore? It was on during your adventures at the North Star Islands. Haven't you seen that one family superhero movie, No Cape? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, that, yeah, uh -huh. it's okay. Well, thanks for the question, Jack. That's the easiest username we've had all day. This next question comes from Pablo and Dugway. Why do none of you use the Emerald powers anymore? You say that like we're actively choosing not to. The North Star Islands are imbued with a magical aura that gives the Chaos Emerald special powers. In all my research, I get to find another area on our planet that experiences a similar phenomenon. So you're saying there's a chance. Never say never! Personally, I wouldn't mind if every Chaos Emerald slowed everyone down. I could catch Sonic! I could finally win a tag! The possibilities are endless! Huh. Maybe it's best we leave those powers on the island for now. Thanks for the question, Pablo. Question from Layla. They ask, Do you guys sometimes feel dizzy when you do a spin dash or jump? If not, why? Wait, you get dizzy? 
Will this anyone else feel dizzy? I used to get a little motion sick, but after spin dashing so much, it doesn't bother me anymore. I spin dash like a pro. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> yeah, guys, I, I don't get dizzy spin dashing either. <laughs> Don't spend it. Did you just say that to feel included? I have. <laughs> uh, thanks for the question, Layla. <laughs> Do you want us to teach you how to spin No. Well, maybe. Uh, ask me later. Wyatron asks Do the Chaos Emeralds have different tastes with the different colors? Kind of, but I think it's my mind playing tricks on me. Like, the green would taste like green apple, because apples are green, you know? Knuckles. What? Have you tasted all seven Chaos Emeralds? Well, you have me hold them for you while you run around. What else am I supposed to do? Just hold them carefully? Okay, so no one here has ever been even slightly curious how the Emeralds taste. I have. The green one does taste like green apple. Okay, see? Bye. Thanks for the question, Wyatron. Dang it, now you got me curious. Don't knock it till you try it. Give me the blue one. This question is from Pestels. Knuckles, does Rouge ever come by trying to steal the Master Emerald? Yes, she does. <laughs> I'm sure you don't mind too much, eh? Knock <laughs> that off. Hi. I'm a strong man. That's not what she sounds like. And I could defend myself, thank you. Defend yourself? You mean invite Rouge over for a candlelit dinner? All right, who asked this question? Pastels? Pastels. I am Knuckles Echidna, last of the Echidna Warriors. And I will make you regret ever asking this question. Did you ever give Rouge those daisies you bought her? How, how did you know about that? <laughs> Thanks for the question, Pastels. No, seriously, how did you know about that? I'm a gossip. Daddy asks me, do you wear inhibitor rings? Hmm. What are those? Yeah, they're bracelets Shadow wears to keep his powers in check. Oh, then no, I don't wear those. But I have been training with Knuckles. One swing of my hammer and crack! Earth would split into pieces. One swing, and you can just shatter the earth into little pieces. She could do it. Okay, so we're completely ignoring science and the natural law of physics by asserting that you heard Knuckles. <laughs> I'm so strong, I can crack the earth. Thanks so much for the question, Yubby. But the science! Thanks so much for the question. Nula asks, what are your thoughts on knowing that you have a biggest fan? I'm a terrible role model, and you shouldn't be my fan. Knuckles, you should be a little nicer to your fans. I've teamed up with Eggman several times, and all I do is sit on a floating rock. But what about your, uh, uplifting personality? Everything sucks. Y you know, I think we'll move on. Thanks for the question, Nula. But I mean, if you want to send me something, I won't say no. Knuckles! What? Two Stars asks, for Tails, where did your fear of thunder come from? Oh, well, before I met Sonic, I would sleep outside a lot. The worst nights were the ones with thunderstorms. Well, they've made me jumpy ever since. Would you sleep outside a lot because you didn't have a home? Yeah. All right, buddy. It's hug time. Yeah, bring it in. All right, group hug for Tails! Oh, you guys! Eggman, you joining this? I don't do hugs. Unless it's for you, Tails. Bring it in. Oh, yay! Thanks for the question, two stars. Question from Shadow's True Biggest Fan. Can I adopt Shadow? He can't say no, he is in the Twitter takeover. Yeah, sure, you can adopt him, why not? He could probably use a friend. It's mostly just him and that dark chow he's been taking care of. You know, I caught him staring at the trees of Luminous Forest for hours the other day. Mm, how do you 
know Shadow was staring at trees for hours. Oh, I, I started standing there with him. You two are cut from the same cloth. Thanks for the question, Eggman's true biggest fan. This one's from Spiro. Hi, Eggman. Are you looking for another henchman? I could be your henchwoman. I'm on your side all the way, Team Eggman. Yeah, no thanks. Too clingy. Really? Huh. I thought you'd be all over someone obsessed with you. The last time I let a fan near me, it was a massive headache. Never again! What was his name? Uh, Starbies? Shoreline? Starline? Uh, no, no, that can't be it. Either way, <laughs> good luck finding another evil dictator to fawn over, Spiro. This next one's from Holtz. They say, since Shadow isn't present this time, what are your opinions on him? <laughs> time for everyone to drop their juicy secrets and gossip. Well, we all know he's edgy, but he does stand up for what he believes in, and it does sometimes align with the right thing to do. I hate to say it, but I kind of respect the guy. I think Shadow's very sweet. He bought me those Hot Honey concert tickets for my birthday, and he has a soft side that he doesn't show very often. But uh, he's a good friend. I think Shadow's a bit of a tragic hero. He lost someone very close to him and has been grappling with that for years. He's very misunderstood. He doesn't talk when he doesn't need to. I like him. Oh, yeah. Probably we're all ready to roast him. Yeah. Actually, his ego is big enough already from these takeovers. Maybe we just don't air this one? Too late. Shoot. Well, maybe he won't see it. Oh, I checked. He's seen it already. <laughs> yeah. I'm so glad Shadow isn't here this time. Well, thanks for the question, Holtz. Let's see, this next question is from The Dog Is Very Cool. Interesting uh, user name there, but I'm happy for you. They ask, can I borrow a couple rings? I want to buy a bag of Funyuns. Oh, I can help here. Oh. Ow! What the heck, Knuckles? Just being a team player. Enjoy your edible rings, cool dog. I think this is for everyone. The Hidden Face 52 asks, what's your favorite winter activity? Well, these gloves are perfect for snowball fights. I'm not allowed in competitions anymore. Snowboarding for sure is my favorite thing to do in the winter. Decorating during the holidays is a dream for me. I started November 1st this year. I couldn't help myself. Hi, <laughs> How about it? <laughs> I always get the sharpest ideas in the winter. Seasonal depression hits me like a cinder block, which is perfect. It's when I cook up my finest world domination schemes. Anywho, thanks for the question, the Hidden Face 52. Wait, most of your evil schemes come from seasonal depression? Like I said, thanks for the question, the Hidden Face 52. This is from Sam. To everyone, how much sleep do you need? Does the fastest thing alive need a full eight hours? Well, personally, I love sleeping, so I'm down for a tight eight hours. I also need my beauty sleep. You don't want to see me cranky. I've been trying out this new intermittent sleep. I sleep 12 minutes, work, then sleep another 12 minutes and work again. It's effective. Is it? Eh, sleep is a waste of time. Best to get it over with. Maybe with a full night's rest, you could actually come up with a competent plan. Eh, of course he's asleep. Thanks for the question, Sam. I'm gonna pluck his mustache. Ow! Autumn asks, how can I convince my dad to get me all Sonic stuff for Christmas? Easy, you tell him. Here, Knuckles, pretend to be the dad. <clears throat> Hi, Dad, I made a list of the things that I want for Christmas this year. Cool, son. Let me see that list. Hmm. Knuckles Frontiers, Knuckles Superstars. Wait, 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 what? Knuckles Origins, Knuckles Dream Team, and so Knuckles Bigger. Okay, that's that, that's not what the list says. And a Knuckles Waffle Maker. Whew. Now this is a quality list. I knew I raised you right. Har har. Thanks for the question, Autumn. Question from Fan. Why is it called an oven when you oven the cold food of out hot eat the food? You know, 
Vanilla, can we talk about tonight's dinner plans instead? I think Vanilla's making pasta tonight. She invited all of us. <laughs> Even me? Probably not. Completely fair. <laughs> I'm there. Answering all these questions is making me hungry. Same. Yum. Can't wait. Or, uh, uh, thanks for the question, fan. That is your real name. At Spongy Rabbit asks Sonic, why don't you just put Eggman in jail? You know, that's a good idea. Wait, what? Come here, Eggy. No, no, no! Wow, that was easy. Thanks for the question. Or, I guess, suggestion, Spongy Rabbit. This isn't the last you'll see of me! At the Fortnite Legend 190 asks, Eggman, why don't you team with Sonic? You guys would be a really good team. <laughs> I don't need any of you twerps. I made my own metal versions. Yeah, but we have souls. Worthless! My family of metal robots would wipe the floor with any of you. Yeah? Name all the times you wiped the floor with us. I took over the entire world and dissolved gun, remember? He's really gonna hang that over our heads forever, huh? Hey! I commanded our army to a resounding victory, Egghead. Well, I, 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 I guess. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thanks for the question, at the Fortnite Legend 190. Excalibur Sonic asks, If flamingos are pink because they eat shrimp, then why are you blue? Do you eat blue paint? Yes, I do. And Tails eats yellow-orange paint, and Knuckles eats red paint. I certainly do not. I do. It's what gives my complexion such a lovely shine. And I love pink paint. Mm, I could go for some right now. None of you should be eating paint. This is highly irregular. <laughs> it's just a bit, Nux. Don't worry about it. I love eating paint. Who do I believe? Curse you, Excalibur Sonic. Curse you! This is from Kitty X Pickle. They ask, to Knuckles, rougher than the rest of them. Are you allowed on the internet without supervision? If yes, please reconsider. Uh, not anymore. Uh, we don't let him on the internet anymore. Not since the, uh, incident. Oh my! What's this incident? Uh, sorry, can't say. Uh, <laughs> thanks for the question, Kitty X Pickle. And with that, another takeover is complete. Oh, it feels like we responded to a record number of questions. There's still so many people that we didn't get to. Aw, it's okay, Tails. We answered so many good and meaningful questions. And a few invasive ones. I know. I still just feel bad missing so many questions every time. Well, here's an idea. How about a lightning round before we wrap up? Starting with Eggman. Why do you wear goggles on your head when you have glasses? Oh, easy. Wind protection and style. Knuckles, what are the spikes on your gloves for? They're... My knuckles? Why is everyone so obsessed with my gloves today? We have a very dedicated fan base, and they have endless bounds of curiosity. That wasn't part of the rapid fire. <laughs> Oops. Amy, I keep seeing people ask what's your favorite era, whatever that means. Oh, I know what they mean. Hmm, lover. And for the record, I know Shadow's fearless, but don't tell me when I mention that. Tails, how do your tails spin without getting tangled? They don't get tangled because I'm careful. To Sonic, where has Trip been this whole time? Easy, protecting the North Star Islands. And one final one for everyone, when's the next game coming out? Uh, th that's enough questions. It was a pleasure answering all your questions, everyone. I'm sure we'll be back sometime. Whatever platform we end up on, we'll see you there. Bye, Bye everyone! everyone!